started with watercolor, but nowadays I'm very interested in doing a lot of um, abstract and using acrylic medium. Everybody like to draw and paint or creating the image that is already exists, right? Like in the shape, a form, it always has that shape and form. But in abstract, you have the freedom of creating the form of your feelings. Abstract is actually very personal for me because it helps me to channel and speak the truth of who I am, how I feel that day, and the character, like of the real, real character of myself without anybody judging the flow within. Like, I believe it's beautiful, therefore it is beautiful. Even though like a lot of people think that abstract is easy, probably it's because they haven't tried. But even so, if they think it's easy, then it is easy for them. But I think what's make it difficult is the understanding of the feelings itself, because you have to dive in into your personal feelings. A new experience like it all I always paint on 2d right so and then to think about like making it into a 3d I'm, I'm sure it's gonna be a bit tricky but of course it's very exciting to try new things every time At the very beginning when I just started, I was just like get in touch into how I feel about it. But once I figure out and I was so happy with the color pattern that I always use and then making it into a real feelings, it inspires me to create a waterfall. Okay, so like some kind of a nirvana of my own thought. The, the waterfall of my ideal world. I think in the VR, the feelings of unstoppable, like allowing you to just flow with your creativity non-stop, endlessly. That unstoppable feeling is just amazing and make you feel like you can create anything, literally anything you have in mind. Now that I know that there is a 
a platform that creates the unlimited feelings, the way I see the painting in canvas is become limited. But this limitation is another different challenge as well because just by this size and this surface is completely different challenge. So both is good in a different way. How do I feel about my creation? This unlimitedness feeling is making me feel like I should do more. I feel like I want to do more because I keep thinking that, oh, I need to add this a little bit more. It's, it's addictive. Gotta love that feeling, right? Because it's actually challenge yourself to always grow and what can I do more and challenge that thought behind in the back of your mind. Personally, my favorite from my artwork is the waterfall itself and all the water surface is actually my favorite because it really shows my character, my my color. I think a lot of people who are just about to start painting, they always struggle with like, I, I don't know my character, oh, I don't know my color. Like, oh, they're always good, blah, 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 blah. The fear of the unknown, right? Not knowing um, what their character, what they're gonna do and as well, in the same time, comparing of what they are capable of, which is that, is, that is toxic. So, stop comparing. Just focus on yourself and do a lot of practice. I mean, to start with, these people who are already now working for 10 years, begin from nothing as well, from practice. It's not like you were born and then you're amazing already, right? So, <laughs> yeah, so just, just practice and focus on yourself, really.